when an emotional mind is arising in our mind stream, we become, right? We fully identify ourselves and become that emotion and then fully charged and with all kinds of expressions happening there. You know, bodily expression, <clears throat> verbal expression, you know, and then of course thoughts, so many thoughts. In that situation, there is no awareness, there is no mindfulness, there is no sense of being conscious. What becomes an, uh, a useful method of working in that situation at the beginning is this sense of a mindful gap. First we must develop the space, this gap, and see you and your emotions are two separate things happening here, so to speak. Okay? There's your, your mind experiencing this one element, which is emotions, right, coming. There's no sense of like, you know, suppressing emotion or ignoring emotion or anything like that. You know, you experience it. Let it arise. Let's, let's experience that emotion, okay? Let's feel it, right? Touch that emotion. At the same time, don't identify with the emotion as yourself. Feel that emotion as it rises and hold. Hold yourself back from <clears throat> uh, engaging in any kind of uh, sloppy response. Uh, usually when we experience emotion, there's no sense of space, right? It's all so intense, you know, packed and intense. And there's no sense of uh, awareness there, you know. Just like boom, boom, boom. You go on and on and on. At the end you realize, I didn't mean to sign this paper. Then you wake up and say, oh, I'm divorced.